Epic intro music! Hello, Painted Wolves! Hello, I can pick this here, and welcome back to part 2 of my Lies of P Let's Play. Now, the only thing that I've done off screen was I found that I had this lightweight frame in my inventory, and I've equipped it. It's just a little bit more physical damage for a bit more weight. And since we're still at 48%, I think that's fine for the moment, and we're using the standard rapier. And we can upgrade, that's the thing that I have to remember, we can actually upgrade it once we get to 200 ergo. So, we're just kind of going to get on with it now, we're going to get on with it, see what's out here. Uh, I don't know, what did you guys think of the Puppet Master, what's his face, the first boss? Have you been enjoying the game as much as me so far? I would love to know, I would love to know. So, uh, we can purchase items from Polandina at the hotel. And yeah, I'm just going to have a very quick, quick explore around the place. Doesn't look like there's anything out here. But yeah, uh, this is the same day as I've recorded the first episode. I'm really excited to get into more. These ones are not going to be as long as the first episode. I wanted to do a longer first uh, first episode, basically. And um, I haven't decided on an episode length yet because I don't know how long the game is either. Um... 20 minutes will be the shortest. Um, I would like to keep it around the 30-35 minute mark. But if it turns out that we need longer episodes, I will. Because I don't want it to go on for like 100 episodes or something like that, you know? So we'll just see how the playthrough progresses. And Oh yeah, let me. Uh, that's what I didn't even ask in the first playthrough. Uh, let me know about audio levels. What's going on here? Bullum and heck. Okay, Black Rabbit Brotherhood. My name is Gemini. We'll okay. talk later when we're safe. Okay, so yeah, I was just going to ask about the audio levels quickly because I haven't actually altered the audio levels since the first one. I don't know if they were good or bad, um, but I'm guessing I'm going to get killed if I step in the light. So I'm going to try and run around it. Okay, and what's going on? Okay, so we can't break the glass doesn't look like we can get in anywhere and we can start up the let's repair the stargazer since this will heal us I might go step in the light and see what happens nope okay I really thought that was going to shoot at me <laughs> nice screenshot uh, place except I can't screenshot because I'm recording <laughs> So do we have to go back to Bay to level up every single time? Okay. Oh, we can talk with Gemini. I'm Gemini, your friendly puppet guide. Or friendly guide puppet? I don't know, one of those. I'm also a friend of Sophia's. Last time I woke up, Sophia was there because... Because she woke me up. But I'm sure there are still other memories in there. Sorry. Must be the shock. Bear with me, and I'll do my best to guide you. Right, just check my mic. Yep. It's been a while since I've recorded, and I always think that I've got it muted or something. Just making sure. Okay, so we've got our first couple enemies here. Okay, so we got a... Oh, I thought that, that's not even a big guy. Backstab. The backstab is very satisfying. I like it a lot. <laughs> okay, got to kill those guys, but just making sure I haven't missed anything. I always need all the loot. Okay, so the basic are, the basic guys are still very easy to deal with for the moment. I don't want to jinx that because I know they're going to get a lot tougher. Elysian Boulevard was a regular rich people row. You wanted fancy boutiques and shops. <laughs> no place better. And I guess we're looking for our master then. For the puppet frenzy. Okay, cross dimensions. Oh, okay, so whatever we just picked up there, that's how we summon in friendly players, I guess, to help out. That's good to know. 
and we need roughly can we check on the info what we need to level up okay required ergo 1078 okay that's good um, so roughly every 1000 will get us at a level now okay so the dog might come first we can get the attract the dog over here now it's woke the others up okay. oh he's got a gun nice little back step there Oh, there's another one. There is another one. Okay. So it looks like there might be a few more traps and dangerous encounters to come. Ah, the first chest! What have we got? The LADA... So I guess that's another defensive... Yeah, defensive part. Uh, so essentially armour. Okay, and we have a ladder. I love the sound. I love the sound. Now we could go back to base and upgrade our weapon. I am risking it a little bit. Should we try to get to 1,200? Don't know what that is either. Okay, so we've got a shooter. Nice. Okay, what is this? Oh, that drops a ladder, so that's a shortcut, I guess. Let's just have a look. Ooh, I love how they slide down. Okay, so we're pretty much back to base now. Yeah, let's get to 1,200 before we go back. Um... Yeah, and I am holding on to that. Uh, that uh, I don't want to call it the Ergo. I, I, I still want to say Souls. Even when I play Bloodborne and Elden Ring, I still want to say Souls. <laughs> okay, so... Ah, nice. Emergency Protection. So it's almost like you can call him in for like helicopter support. <laughs> That's my first thought. Oh, okay, we got a big boy. We got a big boy. Right. All right, let's take him down. Oh. Okay. Okay. Big boy's not playing around. Let's go back to the usual strategy. Oh, we've fallen off. Okay, is he going to jump down? He is. Okay, so I'm just going to punch through him. <laughs> right, so we got a kill and I'm heading back to level up the weapon and level up myself too. Got a nice little bit of loot there too. Right, we'll see if we can handle that guy better as well later. Now I see there's like a little two, so this is kind of like chapter two, I guess. I like that. So let's go to Eugenie and level up the weapon. Hopefully we'll be getting some tasty damage off of it. Way around. Yeah, you do. Right. Um, okay, so for the next one, we need two hidden moonstone. Okay. Oh, and we need. Let's just I check. Know my way um. Yeah, you do. <laughs> I can't not say that. Okay, so we've got to watch out for when we get that technique crank drop because that will increase the damage on the weapon too. I'll use my 
Um, I think we're going to go all the way to 20 on the damage first. I'm liking the sound of that. Okay, so we're going to go to the boulevard entrance. We're going to climb the ladder shortcut and could run past the big boy because um, we've already fought him once. I don't know. I might try and get a better kill. We'll see how aggressive he is. <laughs> but I, one thing I don't want to do on recording is like just kill the same enemies over and over again. Like, obviously, got to take out the ones that are in the way. That was a little bit too tempting, I have to say. <laughs> Ooh, can we look how much we need to level up again? Okay, so 1,100 is still roughly the same. Oh, was he the shooter? Yeah. It's too tempting to take him out though, isn't it? I'm having too much fun with a backstab. Ooh! Is this where I... Yeah, that's where I climbed up. I thought I found a new area there. <laughs> Any drop-down items? Okay, so we got Big Boy. Oh, does Big Boy not respawn? Interesting. It looks like Big Boy don't respawn. Okay. Boom! Oh, I love that. I, I love that. Right. I've not actually taken into how much more damage we're doing, but I bet it's tasty. Look at that. Alright, let's keep these uh, damage increases going. So, how do we use the lantern? Hold on. Is that like unlimited? Yeah, that's nice. So, what are we soaked in? Oil or blood? <laughs> it's gone. <laughs> okay, can't go that way, I guess. Oh, we're being short out. Oh, I don't like the lock-on on the ladder. Ugh. Okay, we're going to need to heal up there. Oh, and there's something to pick up over here. Electric Blitz Abrasive. Right, so we've got a ladder going down there. Nice. And we've got a ladder going up here. What a oh, okay. Okay, so something building up electric shock damage there. that. Okay, so we've got to run across that way. Oh, I'm not liking that weapon. <laughs> it is cool though, it is cool, it is cool. Okay. Oh, we've walked onto it again. Okay. Got to stop doing that. Nope, there's not enough room to dodge past him there. Oh! Oh, that was close to dying. Right. Luckily, I spotted him. Right. So 
So we're definitely gonna die. Uh, Okay, good. So we got health back there. That's good. There is a missing... There's a ladder we didn't go down as well. I've got to go back for that ladder. Okay, so we've got enough to level up as well. The guy on the roof. So we've got a revenge... Oh, there's another one. Okay, and a hole. Okay. That's not good. Okay. Okay, I don't really have time to read that letter. Okay, so I want to go back and probably level up. I don't want to take that big guy on with no health. And there was another ladder. I want to check out where the other ladder went to. Uh, I might cut away rather than just have you watching me run all the way back. But there's no point just losing all my stuff now. Let's just quickly see where this has taken us. Oh, we've got a hidden moonstone. So it's lucky we came this way. Um, no, like NPCs behind doors to talk to, like in Bloodborne. Uh, Dim Ergo Fragment. Ah, this is the shortcut. Okay. Okay, where exactly? I know we've already done this bit. Yeah. But where was the um, place to level up? Ah, there we go. So let's, um, what are we on? I'm probably playing a little bit too safe, but I'd rather play like this uh, on a blind playthrough, you know. Okay, so I don't think we can level up the weapon again. I think we'd need a second moonstone, but we could just have a look. Yep, so we need a second moonstone, but we can still put another stat into damage. Okay, and then after we use all the items, what have we got? Okay, so we've got a lot of new items as well. We'll have to figure out what everything does later on when we need it. Let's use all of that, and we can level up again. I'll use my power. I like how the um, what's it called? Ergo goes blue when you can level up. So we've almost got technique to 20. I think that's quite a round number. And then we could start pumping up the health a little bit or something. Uh, so let's get back into it uh, and take on the big guy. Might have to run through the last area a little bit. Again, I'm happy to take out some along the way because obviously it means more levels for us. So let's see if we can remember the shortcut. <laughs> oh, 
I want to get back to where we were as quickly as possible. Don't want to miss any items or anything. Yeah, that guy definitely don't respawn, which is nice. Good. Oh. Okay, yeah, he's the one with the dodgy, the first one we ran into with that dodgy weapon. Okay, I don't want to get shot or fall off. <laughs> okay, right, let's go. And then we just got to watch out for the ranged guy. Oh, yep, I've used the Fable Art by accident there. I totally forgot that was even a thing. Good, that thing still missed us. Come on. Can we run? Oh, no. No, I thought I could run past. That was me trying to save health a little bit there. Yeah, okay, so running past is not really a viable strategy in this game. Plus, they're probably all behind me now as well. Okay, so now let's try to take on the big guy. Are they all chasing me still? It's probably worth taking them out so they don't attack me later. Okay, and we've used two of the health items already, which is not ideal. Now... Okay. Okay, we've got to get the stamina back. Oh, the stamina builds up quite slow, doesn't it? Okay, so you can still attack us from behind. This guy does seem quite slow though, at least. Okay. Why is he glubbing now? Does that mean he's staggerable? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, 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 oh that feels good. I love that, love it. Okay. Okay. And we've got another chest. Love the chests. Love the chests. Okay, life amulet. So that probably gives us increased max health. That's what I would guess. Uh, we can equip it. Um, let's just add. We can end the episode here, look, because we've got to another stargazer. So. Yeah, let's do that. Let's repair the Stargazer, equip the amulet. Um, how do I do it? Yep, increases max HP, I thought so. So we've got that on. And we'll just go back and level up, because I think... We've got a couple of items so that we should be able to level up as well. Fingers crossed, because I didn't check that out beforehand. Oh, we've only got one. Okay, so we can't quite level up. Um... I might go back and just kill that guy who was standing next to the... Uh... I would like to level up before I end the episode. I 
Oh, look, when you don't damage an enemy for a certain amount of time, they will recover HP. Not something they knew. Okay, so that big guy don't respawn, that's fantastic. I'm guessing if we jump down, we will die from full damage. There's two routes out of this place. Um, oh, he's not, he's the merchant. Okay. Why, hello! <laughs> I know what you're thinking, but I'm not a burglar. Don't worry, I won't cause any trouble. Uh, for your information. Okay, so... Yeah, we don't need any of that yet. Um, I'm guessing that will hurt me if I... Yeah. <laughs> so yeah, I literally just want to kill, like, a couple of people so that I can level up. And we can level up already just from the first one. Okay, so um, I'm just going to head back, level up, and end the episode there. And luckily we figured that little sneaky ambush out <laughs> for next time. And we'll get technique to 20 to round off episode 2. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time. Please remember to like, comment, and subscribe. And remember, you can always follow me on Twitter and Instagram.